newest black belt, Whit McClendon. Come on, sir. His friend Brian Neal held me down inside control for two minutes without bothering to use his hands. He was doing that. He was even coaching other people while he was holding me down. <laughs> this experience told me that I needed to learn some of this jujitsu stuff. And I eventually opened my own martial arts school in K, Texas. And uh, Professor Paul joined us over there. I learned a lot from him over the years. It's been a long road, and I'm profoundly grateful to every single person and there were many that passed my guard, caught me in an armbar, or strangled me. Every time I tapped, I tried to learn something, so I thank you. I want to thank my friends and family who have been such positive influences during this journey. Larry Escher, thank you for drilling with me so that I felt solid coming up here this weekend. Brian Briscoe, my lifelong friend, for his constant encouragement. Christina Prince, thank you for your unwavering support through the years. Seth Miller, thank you for stepping up to be our coach at Chick Mountain. Professor Eddie Avalar, thank you for helping us when we most needed it. And Master Carlos Machado, thank you for inspiring and leading us as only you can. And Catherine Scott, fearless wielder of the shoulder of justice, <laughs> you are the love of my life. And I'd never have made it here without you. I love you. Zig Ziglar once said, it's not about what you get when you reach your goal, it's what you become. I've become a Machado black belt, and I'm even more excited for the journey ahead. Thank you all. Thank you. 